Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Liz Rose. I do quite dramatic makeup tutorials on this channel. I do get ready with me. I do some hauls. I do chatty videos. If you like the sound of that, then please make sure to subscribe to my channel before you leave. So today's video is day two of my kind of like natural glam series. I'm not really sure what I'm going to call it yet. I probably obviously will know by the time I upload this, but I'm going to do this for about two weeks, maybe a month, maybe two months, because it is like two months before prom season and summer. So I'm doing this series just to show my clients and people out there my skills in the more natural kind of spectrum. Um, I do normally do very dramatic colourful looks if you go on my channel you know you'll see I probably will link some videos up there but I want to do a series which shows I can be more natural but they are going to be a little bit glam as well as natural you know not using too much colour but today I have kind of like a purple inspired look so if you're wearing purple probably like a dark purple dress for prom this would be great if you are wearing purple on a night out or going to like a wedding party or something then this would be really nice for you too so without further ado if you want to see how i created this look then please keep on watching okay so i'm hoping my lighting is a little bit better today um, I have like a light on top of my camera which I used to use when I first started YouTube without these box lights but yeah hopefully the light is a little bit better might be might not be I don't know hopefully okay so today I have another natural kind of glam look for you it is coming up to prom season and it's summer so people are going to be going out clubbing a lot more probably and I want to do looks that you can do for every kind of occasion coming up for like graduation, prom, going out, birthdays yeah I'm sorry if you can hear birds outside it's a nice day today the birds are out they're tweeting and yeah quite annoying because I should have done this before I filmed but I'm using the simple rich moisturizer moisturizer anyone else struggles to say moisturizer moisturizer sometimes I say moist moisturizer this is great for dry skin if you have oily skin I recommend the light version okay, so I want my skin extra hydrated so I'm gonna go in with the Mario Badescu rose water I'm running out of this a lot I need to like tilt it to make it go at an angle where the pipe goes. So I am going to be doing my face first, shocker, I have been doing my eyes first a lot lately but I thought why not. So for primer today I'm going to take the Fasali Rose Gold Elixir, this is very very nice and especially if you have dry skin and you're going to go in with a matte foundation and you need a little bit of hydration oh I just dropped like 10 pounds worth of this on my clothes I'm gonna blend that out with a dual fiber brush this oil smells delightful oh my god this feels amazing on my skin okay so foundation I'm gonna go in with the Gerard Cosmetics Essential High Coverage Cream Foundation this is a matte foundation oil free hyaluronic acid and it's got 20 mils which I didn't think it had that less but it says shake well I have the shade pill this is a very full coverage foundation but yet if you can hear that it's very liquidy do I go with a brush yeah I'm gonna go in with a brush and then I probably will go in with a sponge just to blend it out a little bit more
Okay, so it has clung to some of the dry patches on my forehead, but hopefully that will be gone when we set it all and I spray my face with some setting spray. So now for concealer again with the Jar Cosmetics. This is the Essential High Cover Liquid Concealer. Creaseless Soft Matte Hyaluronic Acid. It's in the shade Snow. I think it is a little bit cool tone, like pinky tone, but it is quite thick. But again, sponge. So then I'm going to set it a little bit, because obviously it's matte, uh, with the RCMA No Colour Powder, of course. I'm going to set it with a sponge. Not baking though, as you can see. Pressing that powder into my skin. Now I'm going to do a little bit of contour. I'm going to go in with the NYX Highlighting Contour Palette. I'm going to take the shade Sculpt, which is this shade. Okay, so I'm going to take the RCMA No Colour Powder again and the sponge. I'm going to carve out. Then I'm going to go into the Too Faced Milk Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. This is the lightest one. And I'm going to lightly warm my face up because that contour shade is quite like cool tone. Okay, so then for blush, I'm gonna go in with the Rimmel Maxi Blush, powder blush, in the shade 001 Third Base. This is quite a, a glittery but shimmery blush. It has like, it's pink with like gold reflex in there. So I need a bit of this to liven up my face. It's a very slow pigmented blush. You have to build this up. Quite a bit. I'm actually really liking blush lately. I don't know what it is. And then now I'm gonna wipe the powder off. Then I'm gonna set my face with the Dry Cosmetics Slay All Day Setting Spray in the scent Peach. I was gonna say shade. I'm gonna take the Sleek Solstice palette and I'm gonna take this shade here. I think I'm gonna mix a little bit of this shade just so it's not too light. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is go off camera, do my eyebrows, do this eye, so I know what I'm doing, and I will be right back. Okay, so I've done this eye. I'm hoping it looks good. Today I'm going to go in with the Morphe and Jaclyn Hill The Vault palette. This is the one called Bling Boss. So, yeah, I'm going in with this today. First I'm going to take the... P. Louise base in the shade 02. Okay, so the first shade I'm going to go in with is Mystic, Mystique, which is the dark purple shade. So next I'm going to go into the shade Hush Hush. It's quite an unusual shade it's like a cool tone purple shade and i'm just gonna take that just above the first shade we went in with okay so next i'm gonna just carve out the crease it's just a simple half cut crease Okay, so next, on top of that, I'm going to go in with the Stila 
Magnificent Metals Glitter and Glow in the shade Kitten Karma. And I'm literally just going to go on top of where I just cut my crease. Okay, so now to set that a little bit, I'm not going to go too ham with it, but I'm going to take Bling Bling, which is this shade here, and I'm just going to lightly tap over that just to set it a little bit. Okay, so under the eye, I'm going to go in with Hush Hush, which is the like cool tone purple shade and smoke that all the way across and then going into the darker purple and just go in on the outer corner with the shade just to blend the lower lash line to the upper lash line and I'm going to take a black liquid liner and just line my upper lash line and then taking any black eyeshadow I'm going to press that onto the liquid liner because we lost some pigment because the shadow underneath the glitter made it a little bit like of a weird colour and I'm gonna like smoke this out a little bit I am gonna take some of that purple dark purple and blend that on the outer corner in with the black and of course the lid shade and then for the inner corner I'm going to take the highlight we took on our face the sleek highlighter and I'm going to go in with just the lighter shade and go in the inner corner then for lashes I'm going to take the Tatty Lashes in TL3 they're not like too dramatic which I like okay so I'm going to apply these and I'll be right back Okay, so eyes are done. So for lips, I'm going to take the NYX Suede Matte Lip Pencil in Sandstorm. And then for the liquid lipstick, I'm going to go in with the NYX Lingerie Liquid Lipstick in the shade Push Up. It just looks like this. Okay, so this is the final look. I really hope you enjoyed it. I hope you've got an idea of what look you kind of want if you're going more of a darker purple for prom then this would look stunning and also it would look stunning for a night out because of the sparkle on the dance floor you will be glowing so yeah let me know what you think about this look down below in the comments everything i used will be listed and linked in the description down below if you are new to my channel please make sure to subscribe and like this video before you leave. I love you to the moon and back, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys. Peace. Whoa. I nearly fell off my chair. <laughs>